Next up is our time zone. So this time we're actually going to tell the system, hey, I'm living in Brussels or I'm living in Singapore or New York or whatever. So set the, the time zone. We have here lots of information about time zones, the list of time zones, time synchronization, um, troubleshooting. Okay. We need to do to figure out what region we're from. And then finally, we need to uh, set the hardware clock here. It's set to UTC. We've seen that in the past. It is indeed UTC. And we are now going to figure out, hey, what country or uh, what zone am I in? And uh, take a look at that. I believe we maybe we find some information here as well, list the time zones and all that. But it's not really necessary. Um, we can figure that out together with this. So let's clear everything first. And the idea is to make a link. We're going to make a link but we can first navigate to it. So remember we sh sh changed route where well, we're in a, in, a, in a computer actually, so in our future computer, and we can navigate any way we see fit. So if we say, let's take a look what's in user share, zone info, and then you have all this information. So depending on where you live, you choose the folder you want. So if you do ls, um, no. Let's keep it like this. Um, for instance, let me take a look at, uh, let's take America. And what's what else is there in America? There is Adak, there is Cayman, there is Granada, Panama, Vancouver, Virgin, and so on. So all these possibilities are there and you can navigate back up and say, okay, um, I'm wondering where Belgium is. So, phew, I don't know, uh, it's in there somewhere, but where exactly? Don't see any Europe, or did I miss it? Ah, oh, there is Europe, thought I didn't see it. It's, oh yeah, it's a good example. Nothing happens, you know, I can't find it. It's case sensitive, so big E, Europe. Uh, Oops, now we've um, changed the directory. So we're in the folder and indeed we have a Brussels there. So that's all we need to know. For me, it's user share zone info your Brussels. That's my uh, way to go. So let's go back to my personal. Oh, okay. okay, like so. We're back on my personal folder here slash root and we're going to finally type in our ln and what is an ln mon ln is a link make links between files okay fine so we're going to make a link between the source and where is the source so a symbolic link with an f we've gonna force it if something is there and something is there so we need to force it and we're going to say user share zone info. I believe it was Europe and then Brussels. There are two Brus, Bratislava as well. So Brussels. And then we're going to say, hey, this is actually the symbolic link. Local. You can't just, oh, you yeah, can. There is also already a local time. So that's why we need to force to overwrite it. So there is now, or there will be now a link that the local time is actually the one from your Brussels. Enter. Let's see if the date already is working. 1620. Yep, that's correct. So now the time I have on the wall and the time I have in my machine is exactly the same. He knows that I'm living in Brussels. And that's all you need to do, except there is another line on the wiki which also is uh, in the time zone here so let's make a hardware clock and then you type here sys to hc and that's it and that concludes our part on the time zone